come to the top of your mat with your feet parallel or big toes touching. Roll your shoulders a couple of times, take a deep breath in and exhale out. Interlacing your fingers behind your lower back, inhale to open the chest, maybe even gazing up and on the exhale, push into your forward fold. The knuckles can come and lifting towards the sky. From here, gently relax your fingertips to the mat, take an inhale to half lift, and on the exhale, step it back into downward facing dog. From here, we shift into plank, take a deep breath. On the exhale, push it down to downward facing dog. And now let's repeat that. Inhaling to plank, shoulders above the wrists. Exhale, push it back to down dog. Here, you can also roll your spine gently, shifting through plank, holding. And on the exhale, pedaling it back into downward facing dog. Here you can walk your feet towards your hands into another forward fold. Inhale, half lift. And on the exhale, lifting up all the way to standing, arms overhead. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, rise up, lifting your arms above your head. Exhale, fold. Inhale into half lift. Exhale, palms to the ground and come into downward facing dog plank exhale down dog and here again we'll repeat that same routine shifting into plank belly in inhale exhale downward facing dog and here again you can add on that spinal roll inhaling into plank and exhaling into downward facing dog take a moment shifting into plank one more time on the exhale push down into down dog Pedaling the feet, maybe even moving your hips side to side. Inhale, gaze forward and step your right foot to the front of the mat. Gaze forward, stretch your back leg and come into high lunge. Here, your arms can lift up towards the sky, keeping your shoulders away from your ears. Take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, step your left heel towards the mat and coming into pyramids. From here, you can lift your hands by your hips and come back into high lunge. Inhale in, arms lift. We'll switch back into pyramid, gazing down, exhale. We'll repeat that one more time, shifting the back foot into our high lunge, lifting the arms, inhaling in. On the exhale, left heel comes down to the mat, pyramid, gazing down, coming belly over the thigh. Hold it here, breathing in, exhale out. Drop your palms to the ground as your right knee bends and coming into lizard, open the right knee out to the side. You can maneuver your hips side to side, changing the positioning, really feel the deeper opening into your hips. Lift your right arm to the sky and towards the back, gazing towards your back toes, opening the chest. Both palms come down and let's transition to downward facing dog. Breathing in, shift into plank, pull your belly in. As you exhale, come into downward facing dog. Lift your left foot off the ground and bring it between your hands. Shift your gaze forward, lift your chest and come into high lunge. Arms opening to the sky, gazing forwards or upwards. Take a deep breath in and as you exhale, right heel down, pyramid. Take one breath here and rise up back into high lunge. Arms over the head, inhale in. Coming back slowly into pyramid, exhale out, shift your gaze downwards. We're going to do it one more time. Shifting through high lunge, opening through the hips, arms up. Breathing in, exhale, you can come slowly into the pyramids. Here, take a moment, gazing down, straightening both of the legs. Bending into your left knee, stretch your foot towards the edge of the mat and come into lizards. With your palms still on the ground, just shift your hips side to side, back and forward, really to target all these areas that feel a little bit tight, opening through the left knee and left adductors. Here, push it back into downward facing dog, take a moment to breathe, and as you exhale, start walking your feet towards your hands. Bring your hands behind your knees, grabbing opposite elbows. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale takes you all the way to standing, arms lifting or gazing forward with your arms bent. And here, exhaling back into mountain pose. Take a moment. Inhale in through the nose. 
exhale out. Let's come into straddle, wide-legged stance. Open your arms to the sky as you breathe in, bringing your hands behind your head, slowly start descending towards the mat. The crown of your head is relaxed. Take an inhale to a half lift, and as you exhale, fold. Let's stretch towards the right ankle, opening through the right hamstrings. Take a moment and slowly through center, come onto the left ankle to stretch the left leg. As you breathe in, bring your fingertips to center. Inhale. As you exhale, fold forward one more time. Keep the head relaxed. Here we're stretching the adductors as well as the hamstrings. Your upper body remains relaxed and you can grab both of your ankles if you wish, pulling the crown of the head deeper. Inhale, start lifting slowly. Maybe heel toe your feet and bring your thumbs to the inside. We're gonna take a gentle twist to stretch through the shoulders, one side and the other side. As you breathe in, back to center, heel toe your feet a little bit closer to come into Malasana Yogi Squat. With your elbows inside, try to keep a flat back, gazing forwards and keeping a neutral spine. Wave sides to side as you open through the hips. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out. Let's take a stretch into the shoulders, lifting the left arm up and switching to the right side, lifting the right hand towards the sky. From here, let's descend back towards the mat and give ourselves a little stretch into the glutes. With your right ankle over the left thigh, pull your knees closer towards your chest. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out and slowly release. Let's switch it to the other side. Here again, grab hold of your knee or your shin and pull it closer towards your chest. One breath in and on the exhale, we release. Grab the edges of your feet for a happy baby, pulling the knees closer towards the ground just underneath your armpits. Here we'll extend into plow so feet go over the head. You can keep your hands towards the toes or you can extend your arms towards the edge of the mat. From here, take a moment, deep breath in, and vertebrae by vertebrae, start releasing into your Shavasana. This is your resting pose. You can stay here as long as it serves you, breathing in and just noticing any differences you may feel in your body.